On this millennial review, we're going to be talking about something that should make it quite a bit easier to split some of this firewood that's behind me for bringing in uh, to use for kindling. So what we've got is this cabin Kindle Quick Cast Steel Splitter. Uh, it's a mouthful, but it should be pretty neat. So what is going on here is basically it's a unit that's going to make it quite a bit easier to uh, uh, just split some firewood with a simple hammer. And this piece, it should work out pretty well. So if you just pop it out, there's not much to what comes inside. Uh, but out will come this cast iron splitter. So let's take a look at it here. As you can see, basically you've got this loop which is going to help hold some of the firewood down there. You've got a couple of these small holes. It might be tough to see because it's getting dark, but you can see that it's got a small hole there. That's so you could bolt this down if you want to. And uh, I just built up this firewood shed, so maybe I will. But at the very least, it sits there nice and tight. And then what you'll do is basically you'll take a piece of firewood like this, drop it right in, and you can see that cage that goes around it is, uh, of course, holding that so you don't have to worry about it falling. And then with a hammer, we should be able to get it to uh, split into two just like that. Pop this apart. See if we can get another one going here. There we go. This wood is uh, it's pretty wet. Working out okay. So we'll do this one more time. There you go. The neat thing is, if you don't need to carry it, what you can do is you can use that bottom part. There you go. Just like that. That one fell out, but... There you go. When you're done, if you want to, you can actually use that as a way to carry the stuff. Uh, so, I'll tell you what, this thing works pretty good. I can see with how that was moving around just a little bit that you might want to bolt it down. Maybe put it to a piece of wood, kind of like the picture shows here. Uh, but in reality, I think that worked out pretty well. Well, if you enjoyed this video, be sure to hit that subscribe button. It lets me know you enjoyed it. While you're at it, definitely check my link down in the description below. That way you can get one for yourself if you're looking for one. And don't forget to leave a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. See you in the next video.